Hey everyone, it's Ronnie here at uh, the Norfolk office. Wanted to take a minute for our educational moment today to talk about leverage. Um, I get a question all the time when I first meet somebody for the first time, whether it's doing a second opinion or an analysis on their current investments. And one of these questions that I get often is, what are the rich people doing? People wanna know, what are the rich people doing? Because if I do what rich people do, I'll be rich as well. So I wanted to take a minute to actually answer that question because there is actually an answer to that question and the answer is leverage. So I wanna talk a little bit about leverage today and give you that concept so that you may be able to apply it regardless of how rich you are or may think you are uh, to make your life financially a little bit more efficient and better. So what is leverage? Leverage is good debt. What rich people do is they understand we have the money to pay for everything in cash. But if I have the capacity to go out and get inexpensive, cheap money, which if anybody knows about interest rates now, it's still at historical lows, you can borrow money for cheap. So if you're able to borrow money for cheap and, and use that to buy other things with the money, it allows you opportunities to grow that money over time while you're borrowing money. This is leverage. So ultimately what I try to explain to people is to not get overemphasized with debt because yes, debt is bad in most cases. We don't wanna live outside of our means and accumulate debt. But we also don't wanna go all the way to the other direction where we're not using opportunities financially to better set our situation. One example I give to people is if I owed somebody $5,000 and I had an opportunity to pay in that $5,000 or pay it over time at a small interest rate, it allows me to grow that $5,000 at the same time, still pay them that debt back. So ultimately I still accomplish the same thing, but because I borrowed the money at a cheap rate, I could grow that money over here, which means I don't have to spend as much money by paying that back. So this is a really, really good concept to consider. You should be working with somebody that's helping you identify the most efficient ways to use and spend your money. And as always, we're here to help you with those subjects or any other. So till next time, take care.